It's sponsored intro time. Head over to RL Exchange where you can buy all your favorite Rocket League items. I mean, <laughs> look how crisp that looks. And you can do this on a bunch of different consoles. You can use a bunch of different payment methods and your items will be in your inventory it's super fast. It's super simple. And you can use code Dillbobs at checkout for 3% off. Now let's get on to this video. Yo, what's going on guys? Dillbobs here. Welcome to season two of Rocket League Sideswipe. Let's take a look at what it has to offer. Now, I didn't play season one. Honestly, I didn't play it that much. I've been super busy with you know the main channel a lot of other things going on in the background as well that i've been doing um so I'd, i've not been gaming too much on my phone so i i think i got probably plat on this so you get the rewards just like this as you can see they're limited items we've already seen them their stickers and their titles oh and you actually only get the title for your highest rank you don't get the titles for the ones below it which is fair enough i can't remember if that's how it works in the main game but let's take a look the rocket pass says it's not quite ready let's take a look at the item shop though we have ourselves a Cobalt Scarab, which is nothing too new and exciting. We have Supernova, which is new. A Pink Supernova, which is pretty cool. Uh, we have a Forest Green Aftershock. Yeah, it's alright. I mean, it, it's cool. A Black Tsunami Beam, which is meh, it's, it's alright. Uh, Geometry X Banner. The Breakout Vice, which means the Breakout's here, but we can't actually use it yet because we don't have it. So I assume it might be a Rocket Pass car. Um, you know, it kind of makes sense. And then the mystery items haven't updated at all, as it seems. So I thought these would change through the season. And maybe they will soon. Uh, maybe it's just glitched at the moment. But, you know, there's nothing new there. But let's try and reload and see if the Rocket Pass, you know, finally shows up. Okay, so I reloaded the game and the Rocket Pass seems to have loaded. Let me just check one more time, though, in the mystery items. Okay, yeah, they're not updated. So, the Rocket Pass. Let's see what's in here. Okay. So the breakout is in it a little later, and it's a free Rocket Pass again. There's no premium Rocket Pass yet, which is completely fine by me. No paid content means everything's free. But we claim this, we get the Aftershock for free, um, which is pretty cool. I mean, the Aftershock's all right. I don't think I'll be using it too much. I'll equip it for now, just so we can see. There you go, that's the Aftershock. But let's see every item in the new Rocket Pass, and then we'll leave it there, and I'll start grinding and try and get you guys some sweet, sweet Season 2 openings. Because there might be some new items in the pools, such as 20XX, Dueling Dragons, painted versions of them. Anyway, let's take a look. Number two, we have Pixelated Shades, which is obviously the best topper in the game. Look at that. We have the Ion Boost, which, oh my, that is that is a thick Ion Boost. And look, as you turn it, it actually like goes flat. That is weird. That's cool, though. We've got Septum Wheels, which is nice. I, you know, you can't be a, a bit of Septum. Uh, we have ourselves the Neon Sunset Avatar. We've got a Bronze Present. And now the Bronze Present shows you what you can possibly get. Okay, this is a really nice update. So we can get Shuriken, Pixelated Shades. We can get all sorts. These are probably items in here if we look further. Tsunami Beam can be in here, Synthwave. So the Bronze Present, you know, there's no nice black market. So when we get later to the Gold and Silver, we might find some really awesome items in there. Then we have the Zebra. We have the Helicor Helicoprion wheels, uh, which as you can see, looking like this. Very, very nice. We've got the Mohawk, very rare topper, which is cool. Then we have the Breakout, which, you know, is a pretty good car. It's an exotic car on this, um, but obviously the Breakout, we all know from Rocky League anyway. We've got the Breakout decals here, the Breakout tech. We have Side Swiper, which has a pretty cool tag. We got some, you know, SP. Again, the bronze presents, which have, you know, 22 different items in, which we've seen. Tsunami beam, which makes sense. The sunset wheels, which might be able to come painted then, I guess. Maybe not. Then we have the silver present. Let's see what's in this. 27 items. So the same items, but now there's exotics, which is Cloudburst, which is very nice looking. Actually, that does look really clean. We got the breakout, obviously. So painted breakouts. The aftershock. The Kana decal, which is universal, which is awesome. Let's take a look at that. There you go. So we got the Kana decal is universal on this one. And then reverb wheels, which are, oh, I don't know about them. But yeah, that is the silver present. I really like that they show you what you can get. You get more sideswipe points or salvage points, whatever you want to call them. Synth wave is here. Reverb wheels, of course, are here. Uh, the breakout type S is going to be the black market car at tier 35, which is pretty cool. It kind of makes sense, you know, progress from the breakout. The breakout type S shockwave, which is a really cool looking decal, actually. 
And then we have the Kana, which again, like it says here, Universal. And then the gold present should probably leak what's to come later on. Um, so let's just scroll across. We got the Supernova. Uh, I think the last thing is probably going to be 20XX. So we'll look at the Blade Wave wheels, as you can see. Very nice looking. Um, then we have the Supernova. Oh, and I see Tier 49 is going to be Dueling Dragons. But here's Supernova for you. Yeah, there it is. That is a really, really good ending to this pass. So you definitely want to get to Tier 50 because you get yourself Dueling Dragons. I mean, look at that. It's beautiful. And then you get yourself 20XX. On the Aftershock, be looking like that. Honestly, I can't wait to get myself some painted 20XXs, hopefully in the Golden Present. So as you can see, the Gold Present has everything. Oh, never mind. Okay, I've been scammed. So the Gold Present actually only has the Breakout Type S in, so we can get painted Breakout Type Ss, but painted Dueling Dragons and 20XXs, I don't know how you're going to get them because... Oh, okay, they're probably going to be Pro Presents, I assume. So the Gold Present only has the Breakout Type S. But then once you go after tier 50, hopefully the pro presents have them. So that means I'm going to start grinding because I want to be one of the first people to get some painted dueling dragons. This time, I'll actually fully grind it out and keep going. But that's it from me, guys. That is everything in, you know, the Rocket Pass of Season 2. I mean, I can quickly show you um, if you go to play. You have the casual playlist, which is pretty cool. You got ranked. And you now have ranked volleyball. Um, I'm going to queue into a match of volleyball. I'll queue into a match of volleyball really quickly just so you can see the gameplay. We won't play the whole game out on, on video because there's no need to. But you'll get to see, you know, what volleyball is all about. And that's basically the entire new season. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. I think Sideswipe is just improving slowly over time. Like, it's always going to be getting better for the next however many seasons. So, I mean, Sideswipe content should hopefully always progress and get better. So, let me know in the comments, do you want to see me playing more Sideswipe on the channel? I'll leave that up to you guys. And uh, it looks like we're not finding a volleyball match. There might be too many people or not enough people. Okay, so it seems like um, there's something wrong with the servers, probably just because it's like being overloaded right now. I've restarted the game. We can't find a volleyball match, but I want to get this video out so you guys can see the brand new Rocket Pass. So I'll leave it there. I mean, the volleyball game mode, it's pretty self-explanatory. And I want you guys to, you know, go and enjoy it for yourself. It's probably going to be a lot of fun. I don't know how it will play out mechanically. It might be a bit weird at first, but I think it's perfect for the mobile version. Anyway, that's it from me, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.